Hey, it's Sam here, and welcome to this demo of Message Lock. Now, this is a bit different to your usual content locker in the way that it gathers leads that could be either email leads or messenger leads as well, which are just as important as email leads for most modern marketers. Messenger leads makes it very, very easy to get uh, people to opt in via a single click using Messenger, but it also lets you reach them in a new way beyond traditional email marketing as well. And that's what this is designed for. Now, the other thing that this is designed for is being able to engage in lock content in a more smart way. This is not your typical popover that just pops up at a certain time or at a, you know, or at the beginning of a, you know, an article, a PDF, whatever. This lets you be smart about when you have to pop it go because research has shown that when people are already engaged in the content, say that halfway through reading and the pop-up pops up, they're committed to finishing that article, they're committed to viewing this content, and so you can lock that and get higher conversions using the content locker as well. Now, what I like about this is there is a wide range of uh, different campaigns you could create, so let's jump in and take a quick look. I'm going to click on new campaign over here. So you've got traditional content locker, you've got a lead uh, magnet lock as well, so lock a downloadable file uh, in your article, like in a certain place. You can lock a PDF too, and also a video. Let's take a look at the content lock, the more traditional one. I'm going to call this the Sam Demo. In the lead type, I can choose between email and messenger. We'll just go messenger for the sake of this. Uh, we can choose in uh, one of the chat, bo the chat box, the so message hero, mini chat, chat fuel, or, or if we go email, so choose my autoresponder, and then what I do, once I've chosen my autoresponder, I can choose a list for the leads to go to, and click save. Once I've done this, I just simply click next, and I go through, and I can choose whether I want a normal style, where it pops up over the content completely, uh, or if it fades in. So here's a preview of the fade one here uh, as well, so we can see the opt-in headline, email address, all that sort of stuff. So if I go headline uh, to to find out what happens next, uh, sign up to get access. You can probably use more catchy, uh, catchy taglines than that. Uh, however, that's nice and easy. We can unlock it now for this demo. Agreement for GDPR, uh, we can say uh, you consent to us sending marketing messages. You may opt out at any time. Just for GDPR compliance, things like that as well, we could put that there too uh, for them to do that. Now you can customize the colors, so we can change out the colors, customize how it all looks, keeps it quite simple. Whoops, I clicked out of it. Um, my bad. We'll go previous, fade style. So there we go, I've clicked out of it. I can go back in and click next and just work through. Post opt-in, we can say, thank you. Your content will show in two to three seconds. Okay, so we've got that all saved. And we're all happy. Uh, if we wanted to do the normal style one as well, uh, it's the same, but it just doesn't show the fading around the content. I can click next, uh, locked content area. I can lock all the content or selected content. Uh, I can do it immediately according to time on page or when a user scrolls. So I can set the percentage, everything like that as well, uh, to get them down into a certain part of the off the web page. The cookie setting, very easy. Uh, we can cookie them so it keeps the content unlocked forever or it keeps it unlocked for a certain number of days as well. Once I've done this, I simply click, uh, click save. Okay. And then I get the open tag uh, where I want to start locking the content, close tag to put in, and the body tag as well. Now that is for the specific one because uh, it's quite comprehensive in terms of what we're locking down. If you are just using a standard um, content locker let's go back into here like a lead magnet it'll just give you one line of code uh same with the pdf as well that's uh if you want to lock a pdf file uh or a video it's just as simple as one line of code what i like about this too uh it does do a wordpress plugin so if you are running a wordpress site you can use the wordpress plugin that's included with this and you simply put in short code where you want your content locked it's that simple. Uh, that's basically a quick overview of how to use Message Lock to get messenger leads and email leads.
to see a more detailed uh, information about what's available with this, check it out down below. This is definitely a step forward in terms of content locking, and it is something that is a bit more future-proof than some of the old-school ones, especially when it comes to Messenger leads and the way it locks the content. It's not just an instant lock, uh, and the range of content it can lock as well. This is a very tidy, handy solution. This is Sam. It's been my pleasure to show you through this here today.